So, you have an eight page paper due in an hour and you're totally f***ed. Not a problem. Make a free account with OpenAI and from there you will have access to ChatGPT, which is basically your personal all-purpose life mentor. Think of Cortana from Halo, but in real life. Now if I go up and start a new chat and type in, hello, the chat will respond letting you know it's ready to help. From here, if you ask it to write a five-page essay about why Super Smash Bros. Melee is still popular today, it will not write the essay for me, but it makes a pretty damn good outline. And what you can do is you can use the points in these outlines to start generating paragraphs paragraphs to fill the meat of your essay. For example, it recommends I start my essay with, with a brief introduction over the game and a thesis outlining the main reasons for its popularity. And what we can do with that information is say, okay, can you give me a five sentence paragraph introduction for the beginning of an essay explaining why Super Smash Bros. Melee is still popular today? Press enter, and there you go. Now, if you don't like what it gives you, you can always tell it to regenerate a response, or you can give it new instructions to be more specific. And you yourself don't really have to be specific, you could just as easily say, can you explain Super Smash Bros. Melee to me in one paragraph? and it'll crank something out. And honestly, this is a pretty good intro, but it's kind of boring and it feels like a mundane presentation. And something that you can do is you can tell it to rewrite stuff in a way that people are more likely to find exciting. For example, if I then say, can you rewrite the paragraph in a way that will grab and retain the reader's attention in order for them to want to read the rest of the paper? Press enter, and now, Look what the hell it does. Jesus Christ. Imagine pitting your favorite Nintendo characters against each other in an epic battle to see who comes out on top. That is the premise of Super Smash Bros. Melee, a fighting game that has captivated players for over two decades. Are you ready to join the fray? <laughs> Holy f bro. Yeah, this wasn't a thing when I was in college. This intro totally makes me want to read the rest of the essay. And you can change the size of the content as well. If I ask it to explain why Van Gogh's art style is so popular in a paragraph, it will do exactly that. But if I want to build off of it, I can say something like, can you expound that into three paragraphs? And it will beautifully follow your instructions perfectly. And if you change your mind, you can say something like, you know what, that's too long, can you summarize that into three sentences? And it will then compress the Info exactly like you asked. And of course, you can use my favorite trick to rewrite it in a way that people will want to read the rest of the essay and bam. Now, one of the limitations I've noticed is if you ask it to cite the sources of your information so you can put them at the end of your essay's bibliography, it doesn't really like to do that. For example, if I ask it to explain the limitations of the speed of light in a paragraph and then ask it to give me the sources in MLA format, it will tell me no. But if I ask it to recommend me sources that are likely to have information containing the limitations of the speed of light, it has no problem coming up with books to recommend. And from here, you can tell it, great job. Now organize these into MLA format so that I can upload them into my bibliography. And it will happily do that. So yeah, basically in 2023, chat can give you the structure for your essay. And once you have the structure, you can go through each point and tell it to expand those into paragraphs and keep doing that until you have as many pages as you want. Ask it to recommend the sources and obviously check the sources to make sure they line up with what you're trying to say. If they do, pump them out in MLA or APA or whatever format you want, and you're done. Hope that helps, and as always, hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around.